Alors, ouh oh oh What's up, muggles? How's it going? It's Sophie, I'm back with another video. Yeah. Alright, so in today's video, I'm giving you guys a Q&A. Just because, no reason. I'm currently working on a dark arts collection, that's what I was going to film this week. Where I show off all my dark arts replicas, but I actually want to buy a bit more first before I do the big collection video. So I have to postpone that for a little bit, but that is coming. And I'm really excited to do it because I love the dark arts, I love my replicas. So yeah, that is why I'm doing a Q&A. If you enjoyed this, make sure you give a big thumbs up for me. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on those notifications. I've got all my questions for my Twitter and my Instagram, so if you want to be involved in future Q&As, go head over there and follow me on both of those. Enough chit-chat. I think you know how a Q&A works. Let's get into it. First question is, did you ever buy the Basilisk Head? Question mark brackets. It was from your room tour. No, okay? The Basilisk Head, which was reasonably priced for what I was getting, it was just too expensive. And when I mean too expensive, I mean too expensive expensive okay it takes like a good month to make it's handmade by one person a very talented guy but i just didn't have the money for it maybe in the future i will commit but it was a lot of money snape is with another you what i don't think so mate i don't think so is snape real What advice would you give to a new YouTuber starting out? Find a niche. Find something that makes you different. So many people do the trends, but do the trends, but have your own style to the trends that makes you different, if that makes sense. When I do my Harry Potter stuff, I'm not just relying on Harry Potter, I'm relying on this. <laughs> I don't mean this as in like the beauty of my face. I know that it's not beautiful, but I got a bit angry then, didn't I? I have my own spin on stuff, you know. I bloody have a carved cow Snape and I'm going to marry it soon. Video coming soon. <laughs> what do you think you would be doing if it wasn't for YouTube? This. If I made you a Snape X Sophie edit, would you watch it? Love you. They are my favourite things to watch. When you guys make me edit, it is the greatest thing ever. I love watching them, especially the Sophie and Snape ones. They are hilarious and I love them. It's just, it's just ridiculous, but so good. Do you support every other Hogwarts house? Wait, there's other houses? What? Nah. What is the one thing you can't live without? V-Bucks. Why do so many people hate Snape? He's Gorge. Are you trying to hit on my man? He's Gorge. Excuse me? Where are you from? Hogwarts. Do you hate Gryffindor? Nah. Nah, of course I don't. I love the other houses. I love all five, five of them? Four, four of them? I love all three. There's three others. I love all three others other than Slytherin. I love me, me Hicklepuffs. What? I'm messing with you guys. Some of you actually get offended at that. I'm sorry. Why do you love HP so much? Like, what made you fall in love with it? Honestly, the characters and the dark arts for me. For me, obviously, it's Snape. But there's other characters like Sirius Black and Lupin. You get so, like, emotionally attached to these characters. And if it wasn't for some of them, you know, I don't think it would be as good as it is. And you do just get emotionally attached to them. And I definitely think it is the characters. Everyone always asks, who's your favourite character? As soon as it's, like, a Harry Potter question. When I first heard about Harry Potter I was so shocked because I'm not interested in like magic and wizards and witches I thought what is that what is your favorite Harry Potter thing to do I love going to the Warner Brothers studio tour that's so magical always magical I've gone so many times but I love it even more every time I go but honestly my favorite Harry Potter thing to do is do these videos these are so much fun I am surrounded by muggles none of my family like Harry Potter none of my muggle friends apart from people I've met on the internet like Harry Potter so when I made these videos it's so good to have people to talk to who have this love like just having you guys in the comment section below loving the thing that i love is amazing so this is probably my favorite harry potter thing to do what would you do if the sorting hat didn't put you in slivering that can you answer my question yes i can is that the question what would you do if snape dumped you 
Which video is the one with you upside down in a box in your intro? By the way, love you and your videos. Thank you, Rosie. Everyone always asks me that. Which one is that from? The one where I'm upside down in a box is from the video, The Hunt for the Cursed Child Tickets. I'm basically going everywhere trying to find Cursed Child Tickets. This is the time. It was so hard to get Cursed Child Tickets. And yeah, I searched in a box and it fell over. So there you go. Everyone keeps asking. That's where it's from. Pineapple on pizza. Disgusting. Funniest thing you've ever caught on camera. Well, my whole channel's a joke so <laughs> what is your favorite fortnite skin my favorite is the merry marauder but i also have a deep love for the fish sticks what's your favorite thing to do in real life of the world <laughs> i just realized my whole life is either watching youtube videos or playing fortnite i literally don't do anything in the real world wow i actually don't know <laughs> why are you the best youtuber in the world i don't know i i really don't know are you going to do any hp challenges i want to do some i just don't have any ideas for any so if you do have any hp challenge ideas leave them in the comments down below what does harry potter mean to you so much like honest to god look at look at me okay look at me it's just <gasps> what would you name your hippogriff um dawkins why did you decide to become a youtuber this question is asked so much i just wanted to be a youtuber at the end of the day i saw people doing it i watched youtube all the time i just thought this looks so much fun and it's all by myself so that's why i did it why does snape love you why why wouldn't he just look at me you seem like a really happy person but do you get really sad sometimes of course i get sad a lot of people see my videos and think god she has a lot of energy what is wrong with her i do get sad sometimes of course i do like okay i don't think anyone would understand this apart from other youtubers this job is amazing it is my dream i wouldn't ask for anything else but at the same time you are spending all day by yourself and no one understands this apart from other youtubers no one else understands it my family Family won't get it my friends won't get it and honest to god it messes with your mind sometimes like mm, no matter how much you don't want to look at the numbers you don't want to look at this that you do it's obsessive and yeah it can get lonely and i do get sad sometimes okay so don't let social media confuse you i have a great life i love my life but please don't look at a youtuber's life and think everything is Pshum. Majority of it is pshum. I hate that if a YouTuber complains, everyone's like, mm, oh, why are you complaining? I don't know. I went off on a rant. Don't know if any of that made sense. Have you ever thought about getting a pet snake? Yes, I would love a pet snake. My mum, my brother and sister-in-law are all terrified of snakes, so they would not step inside this house if I had a pet snake. So that's one reason why I can't have it. And the second reason is because I can't even look after a bloody tortoise. My mum basically looks after Dawkins now. I'm just awful with pets, so Okay. Do you listen to Old Town Road? Of course I do. It is the only song on my playlist. I actually really love it. <laughs> what is your favourite time of the day? I love the evenings, but I also love like the 2am where I'm just by myself and jamming out. I don't know why, like after midnight, I'm like, yes, I feel so inspired and I just can't sleep or anything. But yeah, I love, I love chilling like 2am, but I also love the evenings. Do you think you will ever get tired of Harry Potter? Love your vids. It will always be there, always in my heart. I will never get tired of it because let's be honest, Harry Potter, like the last movie came out so there's no more coming out so it's not gonna get tiring it's finished it's got a bow on top i'm happy with it i'm gonna keep loving it what's the hardest challenge you faced my hardest challenge is just not letting this youtube stuff get to my head when are you and snake getting married hopefully soon and you're all invited it's gonna be a big production <laughs> when's your next song coming out can't wait <laughs> i didn't know that i was an artist thanks though i guess in defense of snape was fire why are you my favorite youtuber i'm really don't know but thank you very much i feel like that's like the most asked question in the q a <laughs> just flexing on you which youtubers that aren't harry potter related would you want to collaborate with tgf they're so funny and i think it would just be mental who's sophie oh, okay don't try this on me don't try and turn it around on me this whole who's lily thing don't start the whole who's sophie thing no i'm not having it it's who's lily it's not who's sophie Alright guys, and that is it for all the questions. Thank you so much for watching me. Hello. Um, if you enjoyed, please give me a thumbs up for me. Make sure you hit that subscribe button for more videos to come. We have got the Dark Arts Collection video, which I'm so excited to film. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. Make sure you go follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I love you guys so much. Just thank you. Thank you for being here. You don't understand 
how much it means to me. Any video ideas that you want me to do, go in the comments down below. I will be checking all the comments on this video. I love you and I will see you very, very soon with another video. Bye. And well, hey, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you for watching right up to the end. I like you. You're not a muggle. Make sure you watch my latest video by clicking here. You can also click subscribe to my channel by clicking here and watch any future Harry Potter videos that I come up with. And in the description down below, you'll find my social media links and you may find a bit of merchandise from me. I love you guys. And yeah, I'll see you in my next Harry Potter video. Adios. Whoa, she disappeared. <laughs> <laughs>